and we are on our <laughs> we are on our way to a night market in China. It's quite a small one, but it's the one closest to our area. <laughs> I think the best thing I like about a night market is just the cheapness. Everything is going to be a really good price. You get really odd things. Well, not odd, but you can just get like bras, knickers, shoes, all those kind of things for a really, really good price. come to uh, China definitely cut, try and find one of the local street markets I mean it's just interesting even if you can't fit into the clothes or you're not really gonna try any of the food it's just nice to walk around and have a look and see what's going on because so many people come around and have a walk and you might even get some really good bargains <laughs> Some people are a bit scared of eating street food. I've never been one of those people. <laughs> um, I yeah, they can't wash their hands and stuff like that. But I think we get exposed to bacteria all the time and it's fried so you know eat it at your risk but if you do take the risk it is going to be very nice food. What we got, we got some food. I think most of this while I'm in China it's going to be about food and eating and I didn't post a video yesterday because I was feeling really sick and I think you can probably tell I'm not looking my best. Yeah, so I don't recognise any of these snacks but I can't really get too excited. Um, I'm willing to give it a try but... I think you'd find a night market in most of the cities in China you would go to. It's a very much a Chinese thing. I can't think of a single night market in England. If someone knows of one, please tell me where to find one if it's cheap because <laughs> if that kind of thing would happen in England I just don't think it would be that cheap you enjoyed having a little look at a night market is yeah as I said that was a very small one there are bigger ones and better ones the bigger and better the city but that was a little taste of what you get it's food it's some fashion it's random things it's really nice just to have a walk and look and see what happens in the local community because it's really it's not a touristy place and um, if you have a look at my video you would see there's not a lot of foreign people in that market but if you were to go to the city there are a lot of foreign people around so it's a really nice look at Chinese culture and the local culture of the town you're in so go visit and we're back eating the pinza. <laughs> it is onions and egg in a fried doughy kind of filling. Gong po bing. Gong po po Gong Mm-hmm.